Hey guys, alright, it's Brett from Iron Body Martial Arts, how's it going? And in case you don't know, I'm on a channel here on YouTube that focuses mainly on old style traditional martial arts and conditioning training, but also strength and conditioning training for many aspects of martial arts. So here I have a bag, it's about a 25-30 kilo bag, I wrapped a gear in it, the chains are coming up with the arms, which is what I'm showing you here now. Uh, I'm going to use this as a wrestling analog um, for for like BJJ training or guard training or whatever you want to call it. And I'm just showing it off here. Really easy to do. You don't have to wrap it with a gi. And here I'm just showing, just practice being on your knees or being whatever. And just practice being able to lift it and stand up. Just check the weight, check that it's not too much for your body. Um, you know, this is a three foot boxing bag, weighs a bit. So here's the mainstay of the training is that we're, we're in guard or we're in jujitsu guard or whatever you want to call it. Um, and in essence, this training is simply that we're going to grip the bag tightly with our legs. And we're going to practice. Uh, you see, we can also grip it a bit with the arms on the gi bit there, which is why I put it there. Makes it a little bit more realistic or the arms. But in essence, what we're going to do is we're just going to be training the inside of our legs, our leg strength and our core. Uh, and just by doing all these manner of different things. Yeah, so as you can see, I'm gripping it, I'm moving, I'm changing grip, I'm changing feet. And this is just really easy and cool thing you can do at home to develop that like crushing grip. Then here we go, I'm lifting it. Um, and that again is, you know, mimics something that might happen when someone's wrestling you. Um, but then to have the control of it yourself is pretty cool. So I'm lifting it. I'm holding it in place and I'm just using that like dynamic tension or that static tension of the muscles. Um, so honestly, if you don't do wrestling, if you don't even, um, yeah, do it really, there's still a great method of training like the inner, the inner thigh um, for to have a strong guard, you know. Um, so here's me just doing some passing uh, and those would could potentially be arm bars. Um, and then here's me again just showing how you can reach around the bag. It's a pretty fat bag, which is good. Like I said, it's pretty heavy. And again here, I'm just... I mean, you can do all sorts of variations of this. Um, I've been messing around with loads of different things. Obviously, probably do it on a bit of a softer floor than me. But again, it's all about squeezing those knees together and squeezing the feet. And there's me playing with some grip stuff, practicing some shimiwaza. Um, just good stuff really. It's really just for you guys to play with. Everyone's probably aware of this, but maybe everyone didn't think of just taking their boxing bag down and just, you know, just squeezing it in between their legs, that little bit of training. There's me practicing um, a guillotine, and here's one from the other side. Just practice squeezing those knees together. Just practice the squeezing really. Uh, here's me telling you can also practice the lifting and the slamming. That's a good exercise just to build that whole body strength. And then here's me practicing some uh, escapes. Um, you know, just some usual basic escapes where you're pushing away off your opponent there. There we go. Yep. Just some escapes. Uh, and here we go. Here's You can do obviously the same thing in mount um, where you're squeezing with the knees. And that's what I'm trying to explain here. I used to think it was pretty passive, but you squeeze tight with the knees and you're gripping in and you're really kind of controlling with the hips, um, using the toes. And from there, you can deliver your strikes or whatever you want to do um, if you're doing that sort of thing. But um, there we go, gripping with the knees. I see I've got a little bit more to say. You're lifting again. This is an exercise. Squeezing with the knees again. Gripping, shouldering the bag. Really good. You know, a bit like a kettlebell swing. Again, with it being a thirty odd kilo bag or a bit more, it's it's just really nice training. Anyway, guys, I'm sure you know all this, but give give it a try.